Economist Steve Moore, thanks for joining us. Thank you. We've read you in the opinion pages of the Wall Street Journal, other national outlets. Now you're with the Heritage Foundation. Okay. You're in town today talking about Proposition 127. This is a bill that would install uh, mandates in the Arizona Constitution. Why are mandates in the electricity space so problematic? Well, just look at what's happening in other states. You know, I, I live out east where uh, I see what's happening in states like New York and New Jersey and Maine, where they, ha they already have tried these green energy mandates. And what they've led is to much, much higher electric power utility costs to the homeowners and the businesses in those states. And sometimes, by the way, you see gigantic increases. Um, it's not a coincidence that, for example, New York electric power costs are about double what they are here in Arizona. What happens when you put these mandates in is it requires the utilities to purchase more expensive electric power, and then they have to pass that on to consumers. Now, why is that unfair? For a lot of reasons, not least of which is that it hits poor income households the most because they pay a bigger share of their uh, incomes in electric uh, uh, utility costs. So, for example, we estimate that the average low and moderate income homeowner here in Arizona could eventually pay $1,000 a year more in electric power costs. Now, that's a lot of money if you're living on, a, say, a thirty dollars or $40,000 annual income.